here. I'm Erin, and if you like all things lifestyle, vlogs, unboxing, and reviews, you in the right place. Don't forget to go ahead and subscribe below because I do post two times a week. That's Sunday and Thursday at 9 a.m. Mountain Standard Time. So, 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 if y'all click on today's video, y'all already know I'm coming back today with a velvet caviar case. Cherry Nor Edition unboxing plus review for my iPhone 15 Pro Max and my AirPods Pro 2. And then also I did go ahead and purchase something that I've never purchased from Velvet Caviar, which is some camera lens protectors. They are always recommending these to me, like every time I buy something from them. So I'm like, you know what? This time I'm gonna do something a little different. So I did go ahead and purchase those. So I'm gonna let y'all know if those are worth the money or if y'all should just skip out on them all together. And if y'all wanna get anything in this video, everything will be linked down below in the description box. And then if you also want to get 30% off of your first Velvet Caviar case purchase, my link will be down below in the description box as well. So if you're interested in anything I just said, go ahead and stay tuned. But before we go ahead and get into today's video, do not forget to go ahead and give this video a huge thumbs up because it does let me know that y'all are interested in this type of content here on my channel and y'all definitely should see some more. In the future, so let's not waste time. Let's go ahead and hop right into today's unboxing. So, here is my velvet caviar case package. Let's go ahead and get my trusty dusty knife out, which is always linked in my description box just in case anybody is interested. I'm yeah, probably like, girl. Okay, that should be good. Y'all wanna know one thing I haven't had in a while? Like, the last few um, Velvet Caviar cases I've been unboxing, I've noticed that I haven't got no stickers in a while. So, did they discontinue giving out the stickers? What is this? We'll go check that out in a second. Okay, see, so I know we got that case right here the AirPods case, and then the lens protector. And then this. What is this? Ooh, crap. <laughs> okay. Life's rough, but with you, it's positively perfect. Oh my goodness, that is so cute. Cheers to another year together. Yeah, I am touched. This is so cute. Even though I still feel like they could have included some stickers. Let me know down in the comment section below if y'all noticed that as well, because I know it ain't with me. So instead of me throwing this off to the side like I do everything else, I'm gonna just gently push that. Put that to the side of the camera. So y'all already know how we do this. We normally go with that first. So let's get this off the screen. And let's go ahead and put my AirPods 2, AirPods Pro 2 on the scene. There we go, y'all know what I mean. Now, this background all messy. How y'all been liking this background like this? You know, Ooh, there we go. So this is what the box looks like, which I'm not gonna lie, I was expecting something to be a little bit more cherry, like, you know what I'm saying? This is just giving, oh, this is just a standard case, like, but I guess technically this is a standard case, which y'all get what I mean. It would have been nice to have a nicer looking case, but y'all already know, Velvet Caviar, they never disappoint with the aesthetics of their packaging, even the plain ones. So let's get some close ups. Also, I wish that they would make it the actual case that we got. Because looking at it like this, I'd be like kind of nervous if I didn't know this was the right case for my, my AirPods. God dang old. I would be nervous, y'all. I would be nervous because it's like, it's not really giving me a good demonstration of what's in the box. But, yeah. 
let's get these close-ups. Lovely caviar. So I noticed that it has a bit of plastic. So let's bring our husky knife back. Let's get this bad boy. Bam. Let's get it back here. What they say is not giving a stack. <laughs> I haven't had a case of yellow caviar. Wow. This is not giving aesthetic, y'all. Oh my god. Y'all, I think this is the wrong case. And I know for a fact. Y'all, this is the wrong case. Oh my god. Wow. This is the wrong case. I'm literally lost for words right now. Like, I literally have no words. Because this has never happened to me, y'all. Which, I'm very upset, y'all. But we can still look at this case. Because this is obviously going back. Because this is not going to fit my... How can they do... How could they do this to me, y'all? And I was waiting so long. And I was so happy to get this case. And this is how they did me. They did me dirty. Love a y'all. Y'all did me dirty. This is the first time y'all ever did me like this. And I just, I'm sick. I am literally sick right now to my stomach because this is not what I expected. So obviously in this case, um, we're not able to try this on and really do what we normally do. But I can still show y'all this and we can just get some close-ups. So this is what this is looking like directly. This is what this is looking like directly outside of the box. This is so cute. Ooh, crap. what they say, edit that out. <laughs> this is so cute, y'all. If this would have been what it was supposed to be, I would be so happy right now. And y'all, guess what? It came with a heart. Y'all know I love when they have the hearts instead of just like the regular like O-ring, like the heart. But my heart is actually broken, y'all. So, at a glance, I thought I'd give y'all these close-ups. I feel like it does have a lot of potential. And right now, since this is not the actual one that I ordered, I'm going to have to give them a three for sending me the wrong AirPods case. But the actual design of it is still cute. I would give this an 8.5 if it was the correct one to fit my... AirPods Pro 2. So, if y'all do want to go ahead and get this, if y'all have the regular AirPods case or the regular AirPods, not AirPods case, but you know, y'all know they go hand in hand. If y'all have the regular one, I would still recommend this. So, guess that wraps up this part because we can't do much with this. <laughs> so, I'm gonna see y'all in the next clip, and we're gonna hopefully unbox um the actual phone case that fits my phone <laughs> in the next one let's go ahead and put my iphone 15 pro max in the color natural titanium on the scene and here is the case that we will be unboxing here today y'all already know the drill let's get some close-ups of this case in this box before we go ahead and get inside the box pretty and protective y'all already know the well, caviar's standard Packaging. Let's get on the inside, y'all, because I've been waiting too long. I'm so happy right now. I'm going to pop this bad boy out.
So this is what this case is looking like outside of the box. And y'all see we got some plastic. I have not opened a velvet caviar case in so long with some plastic. I'm sorry. <laughs> Let's get some close-ups of this case before we take the plastic off. Ooh. Mm -mm -mm. Love caviar. Y'all know what y'all doing. Y'all see them black borders. It's given very much chef kiss. <laughs> if you focus on this, too busy trying to focus on that box. Interesting, okay, so y'all see it actually has a button for the action button, which the Bratz case, it was just like a cutout, so that's interesting. I love this style of velvet caviar case. It's like the whole box style instead of like the rounded style, like how the Bratz case was, like the one I just had. know what that is and on the inside y'all see you got that bubble material and this is a match safe compatible let's get to the moment of truth y'all cannot tell me taking plastic off of phone cases or anything just don't be chef kiss because that was just chef kiss so y'all see this is what it looked like without the plastic on. And I've noticed that lately the velvet caviar signs have been protruding out of the back. Which I really do like that little, you know, that little new nice detail that they recently started doing. I actually got a comment that said that this one person told me that she didn't really like that. I actually like it though. That's nice. Let's go ahead and try it on. So happy I got a new case, y'all. <laughs> and this is what this is looking like on my natural titanium iPhone 15 Pro Max. Let's get some more close-ups. Mm. Y'all already know it does have that raised camera ball. Perfect cutouts on the bottom. These buttons are very clicky and easy accessible. Oh, why is my phone back on when I turned it off? And it does have a raised lip in the front. Let me actually turn this phone off real fast, y'all. Because y'all already know, front screen protected if we lay it flat. At a glance, like, this is so cute y'all know i really don't be giving stuff tens i feel like i've been giving out a lot of tens lately i think i might need to pull that back when i get it but on a scale from one to ten what would y'all rate this case because this is so cute in person y'all my biggest concern is i wonder if the back is gonna like change colors or if it's gonna transfer colors easily like that's one thing i'm really really like interested in finding out but y'all already gonna know that in the one month updated video like i always do so yeah i know just stay tuned so what would i rate this on a scale from one to ten i could easily like i said i can give this a nine this is so cute y'all and i love that it do got these black borders which means they won't change colors yeah, I know that's like one of my biggest pet peeves with velvet caviar cases. Like. All right, I really want to talk to y'all about this, the lens protectors, which I won't put on on camera because this is just like putting on screen protectors. I feel like it'd be a lot of pressure to do it off camera, so I can just imagine me trying to do this on camera and do it perfectly. So I am going to open it up right now so y'all can see it, and then we go pan out, and then pan back in, it's going to be on the phone, so y'all yeah, know. So this is what the actual box is looking like. Okay. So 
am I supposed to like? Oh. So this is what this is looking like straight out of the box. Blinged out lens protectors. I haven't seen nobody with nothing like this like in person. So let's see it like close. Mm. Mm. Today is the day, y'all. This is nice, y'all. Now y'all know, if y'all are not new to my channel, y'all know I don't play with these. Like I just do what I wanna do, then I put the stuff on how I put the stuff on. So if you are new to my channel, like, yeah. I normally don't do this, but I'm gonna do it this time because I wanna make sure I do it correctly. So let's go ahead and add this to my phone. And then when we pan back in, we are gonna be in action. So I'm gonna see y'all in one second. So now I'm back with my lens protectors on and I won't lie, this is making my phone look real blinged out and glamorous. Let's get some more close-ups. Y'all see that? It was super easy for me to put it on even though I don't think I did it the way that I've seen people do it online. But I feel like as long as it's on and I do feel like they're on correctly, I guess that's all that matters. So it does slightly protrude from the top of the case, but I don't feel like, you know what I'm saying, if I laid it flat, anything's gonna happen to the lens protectors because we do have that little bit of protection from the raised lip on the back of the case. So that's something that y'all should keep in mind because even like this, you wouldn't be able to know unless I did something like this. And y'all can kind of see what I mean, like. So that is what this look like. Y'all cannot tell me that this is not the cutest. So let's go ahead and let's bring this on. We bringing it all on, even though y'all do not know how upset I am that they did not send me the right AirPods case. Like this really hurt the heart, y'all. Like, I'm not even saying this to be funny and nothing. Like, I'm, I'm really heartbroken about this. Y'all know I be unboxing these cases and for y'all to send this to me and I'm on here like, y'all go ahead and get this. And it's like, yeah, they messed up my order, but yeah, like, I don't know. But this is the first time they ever did anything like this, so I'm not gonna be that critical of them. Mistakes happen, so y'all already know. When I come back with my updated review of this case combo, I'm gonna have the correct case for my AirPods. So let's just get some more close-ups. Super cute. Now this is so cute. Like, I'm so happy I got this. Like, I'm not even gonna let this ruin my day. Because at the end of the day, at least I have this. So cute. So if y'all do wanna go ahead and get this case combo, it will be linked down below in the description box. And also, if y'all wanna get 30% off of y'all first Velvet Caviar case purchase, go ahead and click the link down below in the description box. And y'all can get this for like this case combo. I don't know how much it'd be together with just these instead of this, cause you know, yeah. So if y'all do wanna get this, y'all can get it, you know, 30% off, can't beat that. And if y'all also wanna get this as well, you know, it's also linked down below in the description box. Cause now y'all see how it all looks together, put together with the lens protectors, the phone case, and then y'all know what y'all know, <laughs> this. So with that being said, let's get ready and wrap up today's unboxing and review in the next clip. So if you made it to the end of today's video, yes I see you and yes I do appreciate you. If y'all wanna see more content just like this and from me on my channel in the future, y'all know what y'all need to be doing. Yes I mentioned at the beginning, but you know I love many y'all. 
the end. Do not forget to go ahead and give uh, this video a huge thumbs up because it does let me know that y'all are interested in this type of content here on my channel. And y'all definitely should see some more in the future. It will also help push me and my channel out to a wider audience so we can hit 1800 little hearts, aka 1800 plus subscribers here on my channel so we can continue growing here on YouTube. Also, y'all know the drill, y'all know what's coming next. Do not forget to go ahead and subscribe below because you already know I do post two times a week and I never, ever, 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 ever miss an upload. Yes, y'all can, come on. Back check me on that. But before I let y'all go, I have to let y'all know that I do love and appreciate every single last time here on my channel. Y'all know y'all forever. In my heart, and I will see y'all in my next upload.